have like a popcorn movie then i guess that is good so if you don't know what popcorn movie is it's basically you just want to watch it with a popcorn you know that feeling of going to the cinema and just wait a minute you know that feeling of going to the cinema and just watching it with a popcorn because oh my god bro. hello and selamat kembali ke roger sessions gigafy all about movies Saya Sarah and on today's episode we'll be talking about something similar than last week's movie It's Highland Tower I really really want to say that I never really watch Asian horror especially Malaysian because I live in Malaysia and I don't want anything to happen to me watching this whole ghost stuff because of Sadako coming out of TV or something Wait, is it Sadako or Ringo? Okay, you know what? So there's also a story. A few of his friends went to Highland Tower to just, you know, play for fun, you know, go searching around, yada yada. Then they, after like walking around Highland Tower for a while, and when they went to eat, this uncle like tiba tiba look much I'm like, hmm. I don't know. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna dramatize this story, but I I, I apologize to the people who originally was in that state, but hmm. And the friends were like, "Ah, jump, tip, tip, move, 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 So after that, they were like, they're finished, and then the uncle came to them and were like, oh, "Um, where are they? Where are they?" the 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 guys were like, "Get up, Papa, Chinatown, jump, tip, tip, move, 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 The next thing they did was like he pointed at someone within the group, say kau balik sekarang. Then the pachi was like the go, the other guys macam korang bawa benda yang tak patut di bawa something like that. So they were like oh shit we brought something else. Ki balik to Highland Tower and to like oh balik kawan dia was like kawan dia nangis nangis like so kenapa tinggalkan dia apa semua tu. Highland Tower is not to mess. Eh? I think this is the first ever fan footage in Malaysia. I'm not really sure, but during my research there was another fan footage film which is Ia Wujud. I'm not sure if I'm gonna review that in the future, but do let me know. Which came out first is Ia Wujo or Highland Tower first. The movie is directed by Pierre Andre. I think a lot of people would know him because he came out the most scariest horror film during the 2000s, which is Chongka and Paku Pantiana. So did you know Highland Tower actually had an accident during December 1993? Apparently there was a landslide, one of the buildings wasn't stable, so it collapsed and caused 48 people to pass away. Now there is only two buildings standing and it has become one of the most adventurous secret hotspots in Malaysia. So yeah, today you guys learned that apparently Highland Tower had an accident during 1993. You now know that there's now a movie like 20 years after the incident about said Highland Tower. And apparently a lot of people have also mentioned that it's a very haunted, very hot spot place for ghosts. So this is my review of the movie. I didn't really like them using HD camera for this movie, but I understand because they are meant to film a documentary. But would it make sense if you bring the camera at a location at the rubbles and lubang everywhere that could almost cost you seribu ringgit? Of course not. Plus, I remember that they rent this camera and imagine bringing a rental camera from a company that sponsored you. This camera would be. Devastating. I mean, you wouldn't cry because you suddenly saw a ghost. No, you cry because you suddenly accidentally dropped the camera. I want to also mention something good about this film because it introduced us Malaysians to found footage genre. Um, I really, really heads on to Pierre Andre for opening a lot of things. Like he made me scared of Chongka for a reason, and that's crazy. So I feel like during that time, a lot of people were experimenting a lot of movies. So I really hope they'll bring it back. Also, I don't really like the obvious red circle whenever there are ghosts popping out or highlighting to focus to focus on the ghosts. 
the wig is obvious as hell especially that one scene either the actor the cast is tall or they use their hand to imitate the ghost peeking out from the room i wish they used real sounds i get it the baby crying and editing magic but it sounds so close like it's so close to the mic I don't know. I don't know, but you know, the screen could be made by somebody. And like you, you are filming at a location that is supposedly a heavy ghost hotspot. You know, so I realized too their reactions are very slow when they need to elevate their scares. But consider the two queens for the possession scene. But then again, it's like one of my first ever viewing of Malaysian horror film. I don't know, take my word with a grain of salt. So, should you watch it? It's a movie that, you know, if you are willing to, you know, not try to move in that thing, or maybe I guess so. It doesn't really suit my taste because it has a lot of cliche. But then again, this movie came out during 2013. So I get it. The cliches are there. They took more inspiration from Paranormal Activity rather than Blair Witch Project because I have this problem where I know I can see the similarities. I Basically, the chair and the suso, and then the CCTV view. It's something that I personally don't think Highland Tower should have those type of scenes rather than using Blair Witch as like the inspiration. But it's not a bad movie, so you can watch it regardless. Um, but make sure to remember to pick it up one day. It's not a good nor bad movie. It's a movie that if you want to have like a popcorn movie, then I guess that is good. So if you don't know what popcorn movie is it's basically you just want to watch it with a popcorn you know that feeling of going to the cinema and just watching it with a popcorn because look how popcorn is so good okay i think that's all for today i hope korang boleh datang ke gigify untuk movie movie review bila korang tengah stuck nak tengok movie apa and also give this video a like and subscribe to rojak session for more more content this is sarah your host at gigify and i'll see you guys next time peace out <laughs> Oh, yeah.